Well, guys, looks like we're back. Lightning Sorcery U8. Although, I don't like that my face is no longer my face. Who is this guy? Ugh. I mean, there's like three character models. It's it's me like this, or me like this, much older. Ugh. I mean, at least I can keep my hairdo. Although, every time I restart the game, I, I immediately grow like a full lock of hair. Lush, or lush, lush. A, a bunch of hair, which... I mean, if it, if it was in real life, I, I couldn't be happy, but no, nope. bald is beautiful. So, this, this is me. This is the new me, guys. This, and everything you're about to see before you, this is Blade and Sorcery U8 Magic Update. So I may be a little late to the U8, you know, showcasing party, but don't worry, you guys know me. I'll show you the best things that I can perform for you guys. Uh, maybe we'll find out some new stuff and uh, little tips and tricks. And with that, let's go fight some bad guys. Alright, so new map, who dis? This is the Citadel. Tons of crazy stuff to do here. I've seen some other people jump off the map, climb over to those mountains, explore all sorts of different terrains. I myself have not gone anywhere uh, too far adventurous yet. Just played here and up on top. Huh, I think it would be cool to go all the way up there. That little... I wonder if I could go through those windows. Hmm. What the hell is wrong with my finger? So apparently, right over there, some secret tunnel. Uh, everyone talks about a torch in there. Uh, we'll try to climb over there later in this video. I don't know what's in there, but we'll find out. We'll find out together, guys. God, this little crooked booger finger. So back in all the old updates, the coolest thing I could show you guys was mod of weapons, this and that, trying to do fighting techniques. But of course, with U8, we've got brand new tools to play with, and that is magic. So with magic, each spell has its own kind of sub-spell that you can do interacting with weapons, uh, particularly with magic staffs or just how you cast them and we'll run the gauntlet of a couple different things to show you guys and you know we'll just we'll just have some fun you know that's how I always like to do things I'll try to be as semi formal as I can with casting all these spells just to show you guys what's new how to use them what's cool about them and you know what can Yang Bang do when he has magic in his hands uh, we'll start with fire so, fire, I've found with the vibe controllers, it's best to aim with the pinkies. Oh. Like I said, <laughs> best to aim with the pinkies, that's because it's a little complicated to use. But hey, it's hella fun, and as you guys can see, it's like missile guided. Boom, right in the knees. Far shot, let's go. Nice. I mean... That's what I'm saying. The magic is probably the funnest thing to do now because it just adds to a whole new degree of what you can do and what kind of goofness you can get into. Ah, like missing targets. In your face! In my face! This map is a little heavy on the CPU, so I think a lot of people are, are experiencing a little bit of lag. I gotta say, the most disappointing thing is when you're getting ready for that fireball, and you miss! Ugh, good. More oomph. I need more oomph. Ay, ay, ay. Come on now. Alright guys, last one. Kiss of death. Alright guys, this is the last one now. Kiss of death. Holy Jesus, I cannot aim. Alright guys, here we go. Last fireball, kiss of death. Fuck. Okay, last time guys. Fireball, kiss of death. Oh my Jesus. Okay, I said this is the kiss of death, damn it. Take my love. Alright. So magic does come with different sub-spells, like I was saying. You can cast it solo with one hand, 
Or you can put the two spells together, well, the same spell that is, together and cause a, a bigger spell. Sadly though, Fireball doesn't allow that yet, so no cool Kamehameha. But the one spell that does do that is Gravity. So for dramatic effect, I've got some uh, handy dandy props right here. Let me show you what happens when you combine the two spells. There we go. And Zazam! Holy crap, I suck at this. So like I was saying, put the two spells together, and Gravity Ball. Check that out. So now it's kind of like you're in your own uh, hyperbolic time chamber. Lasts for about like, what, 8 seconds or so? Pretty nifty if you're surrounded by bad guys. Idea. I forgot to show you guys something. So, different forms with different spells. Let's go back to that fire spell. And what you can do, you can light your weapons on fire now. Look at that. Fancy, fancy. It's a really cool party trick at barbecues. You know, shish kebab stuff right away. And also, shove weapons deep into rock. Pretty much a, a lightsaber at this point. Can we agree? And last but not least, lightning. Now, I love the sound effects of these things. Now, this is some serious Emperor Palpatine shit. And pretty much sounds like a Tesla rave party. Uh, the electricity ones, not the uh, SpaceX ones. Okay, I think that's enough showcasing for now. It's still the same old blade and sorcery that we all know and love. Uh, let's actually just put these things to the test and uh, kill some bad guys. Yeah. Alright, so I've seen a few people try to get to that little tunnel over there. It's right around that corner. Uh, I'm gonna try my little nifty way of thinking how to do it. Okay, that wasn't supposed to happen. Okay, so I was trying to reverse grip that sword. Uh, let's try this again. I wonder if I'll be able to reach it. Doing it this way. Ready? Alright guys, you ready? Here goes nothing. Okay, yeah. That didn't work at all. Alright guys, let's try this again. Yeah. Off to a good start. Here we go. 
no! Damn it! <laughs> Shit. Okay, so maybe that antique sword isn't working out for me. But we're gonna try this one then. Come on, trusty spear. Don't fail me now. Let's do this, guys. Soot! Ah! Oh, sh... Ah, uh, okay. This is becoming an issue. What if I just, like, go up the stairs and then drop down? Would that be cheating? No. Succeeding is never cheating. Just kidding, kids. Please don't take that advice seriously. If my calculations are correct, if I drop from here, I should land right above the doorway. Here goes nothing. Hmm. Okay. That was anticlimactic. I haven't played anything scary in a long time. So, this is scary enough. Fuck. Man, fuck this noise. I ain't going that shit. Ah, shit. Alright guys, I think I'm going to bring this video to a close pretty soon. I'm going to do one last big fight for you guys. And then, yeah, we'll call that good. I'm going to actually jack up my mana pool real quick. And we're just going to make these bad guys eat fireballs. So, let's do a hard four. That's pretty easy. Nah, that's pretty easy. Alright. Gonna go right over here. This is my safety square. And you are trespassing. So that was pretty fun. Tons of new stuff to do. Tons of new uh, fighting methods to try out. Uh, the only thing is the lag. Sometimes that lag is killer. Um, 
I think I uh, had a couple lag spikes there where I was just like, what is happening? But besides that, the game's pretty good. U8 is definitely a step in the right direction. Uh, we'll just have to wait for Cosby and his team to kind of polish things up and make it more playable for us. But hey guys, until then, I'm Yang Bang. I'll see you in the next video. Peace out guys.